All right, guys, welcome back to the channel. DVDs, nuts, and popcorn coming right at you. Basically, I've been cheating all week. I basically threw out the diet. It's Thanksgiving week. So be it. I'll get back on it next week. All right, so I'm out and about, and I've, you know, I go to a Goodwill over here right next to uh, Miller's Cafe all the time. Looks like Tony's Pizzeria has closed, probably COVID related. Uh, financially because of COVID uh, they probably shut down was thinking about trying that out found out that they it's it's you know it's cl it's locked up there's nothing going on in there so looked over at Miller's Cafe went on Yelp checked out the reviews reviews are kind of they're kind of mixed I would say but it seems like a lot of people when you do see the good reviews on there it's always about the cheeseburgers there the hamburgers so we're gonna try one. We've been doing a lot of hamburgers lately. By the way, what do you guys think? Finally shaved the beard off. Went with the uh, straight 90s goatee. So, the burger looked really good. I heard, I heard good things about the Frito pie. And I remember growing up playing Little League Baseball and the concession stands would always have the, uh, you'd always get, I would always get the hamburgers and the, uh, the Frito pies. You know, it brings back nostalgic memories, man. I really enjoyed Frito Pies growing up. So I heard some good things about the Frito Pies here. We're going to try that. I'm going to try the burger. I'm not getting fries here. Burger, Frito Pies, and that's going to be a wrap. All right, guys, so that's it. Um, I'm going to go in. The food should be ready by now, and we'll uh, we'll have another video out of it. Did that even make sense? No, it did not make sense. Miller's Cafe on, what are we on here? This is Bay Area Boulevard. And what's the cross street? Space Center and Bay Area Boulevard, Miller's Cafe. All right, so the, the place already wins points. Uh, it's basically, I mean, it's cafe, but it's, it's like a diner, okay? And in the middle of the dining room, they have a big ass cooler in there full of ice and beer with a sign that says, help yourself. Very Texas right there and uh i think it's cool but um i don't think they're giving them away even though it says help yourself you probably have to pay for them all right so comes in these white paper bags they had a triple what was it a triple yeah they had a triple cheeseburger there but it seems like a decent size Wow, these are bigger than I thought. I'm really kind of in a bad location. The weather is just shit down here. It is literally rain for 24 hours straight. A little Frito pie action there. I need to get my tray. So yeah, it's been real nasty here. Oh, what? It must be some kind of tropical storm. Okay. Interesting. All right, let's take a look at this. You don't see that every day. It's got those... Uh, I don't know if those would be considered sesame. Probably not. It's some other seed. We've got the toothpick in it, the classic diner style toothpick. Plenty of pickles. They don't chinch you on that at all. Plenty of tomatoes and onions. Good size, good size burger actually. Looks decent. And then, come over here to this chili cheese, not chili cheese, uh, Frito pie action. It's looking pretty good. Phone telling me. Oh shit, I'm running out of time, it looks like. Am I running out of time? 
I better delete some. All right, had to clear up some space on the phone there. I'm not gonna hesitate anymore. The bottom of this is starting to get damp already. I can find my fork here. Hell, there it is. All right. Guess we should have some kind of action here. There we go. All right, let's try this baby out. Interesting tasting Frito pie. Hmm. My taste buds need to, uh, to acclimate themselves to that. Or decide what the fuck I'm eating here. That is not a good Frito pie. They have made a decision. My taste buds hate it. All right, let's try this burger out. That's why we came. No, oh, shit's flying everywhere. Those black seeds are falling off everywhere. Mmm. Okay. 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 Juices. Yes. Lots of juices. <laughs> okay. I see why people like this place. Wow. That was a good bite. Going in for a second one, guys. Mmm. So juicy, so this is a really good burger. It's one of the juiciest burgers I've ever had in my life. And notice this, you don't see any kind of drippage, no kind of platinum rain going on here. And um, you know, like Burger Nation, I mean, grease is just flying off of the burger. It was it was a, a storm of uh, grease coming off the burger. You don't need that for the burger to be great. There's hardly any grease on this burger and it tastes amazing. It's juicy as hell. Natural juicy. Mmm. Mmm. That was the first bite. I got the juicy hamburger with the tomato and the onion all simultaneously. That was incredible. Mmm. Very good burger. And that's why you gotta put some stock in Yelp sometimes because people know their shit, man. This place is rated three out of five stars on Yelp, but the people that are rating it lower are not because of the hamburgers. It's because of other foods that they have there. They know how to do a good burger here. Mm. 
I do not know how to do a good Frito pie here. I'm eating this straight for nostalgic reasons, not for taste right now. Thinking about that home run that I hit at Freeway Manor. It was like a laser shot off my bat. People were talking about that for months. It didn't do, woo, it didn't do one of those. It went like RBI baseball, the, the video game. This one, it was out of here. I used to be a real good Little League baseball player. Yeah, this Frito Pie is bad. And I'm trying to figure out why it's bad. I think the cheese they use on it is really cheap. And the chili, yeah, it's the seasoning on the chili. The chili seasoning is horrible. So that would lead me to believe I need to stay away from their chili burger. I notice that's on the menu. Every bite of this just exploded in my mouth. Every single time. Crazy. The beef patty is almost like it's a water bed or something. It's filled with water. <clears throat> I'm gonna assume this is not a national chain, so for my local people, you want a good burger? Go over to Miller's Cafe. Tell them I sent you. Yeah, just a dreary, miserable day. It's a very 2020 vibing, vibish day. It's a very cancel everything type of day. I don't know if I can finish that. The seasoning is just horrible. It's actually a spicy seasoning on a Frito pie, which is just uncalled for. Every bite. Man, this is, this is some good stuff. <sighs> Sorry, guys. <sighs> I'm really enjoying this. It's reminding me of, the hell was that place called? Over and Under Sports Bar and Grill. This is not a fast food restaurant, so I can't compare it to fast food burgers. I will uh, compare it to bar and grills. And I'm trying to remember what I rated that one. I think this one might be better. Wow. It's a really good burger. <clears throat> Trying 
trying to think if I have any stories for you guys or anything that's going on. Ow! Motherfucker! I squeezed this shit with my hand. The fucking, uh, fucking toothpick got me. Uh, I don't know why I keep going back to these Frito, this Frito pie. It's horrible. My mom used to say, make sure you finish all your food. There's, there's people starving in China. Well, that's it, guys. I'm going to go ahead and give this burger. Man, that's a tough one, man. I'm in the fours with this one, which is holy grail territory. Ugh. I think I'm going to give it. Four point two. Well, there you have it. Miller's Cafe. Check it out. Space Center and Barrier Boulevard. Webster, Texas. I'm back to eating this pile of shit. Alright, that's enough of that. I don't really have anything interesting to say today. I don't, you know, I'm thinking about the fact that I've been out of work for so friggin' long. I'm thinking about, I'm receiving unemployment, but I'm making a lot of money off of eBay, so I'm wondering if I'm supposed to be telling unemployment that I'm making money off of eBay. That's starting to worry me, concern me. What you in jail for? I robbed a bank. What you in jail for, white boy? Um, I forgot to tell unemployment that I was uh, selling stuff on eBay. I don't know, man. Well, uh, and I guess unemployment's ending soon. I don't know. I haven't heard anything. We're supposed to get a second check, stimulus check, but I don't. I, I guess that's went away now. I'm not sure what's going on with that. Um, I'm just concerned. I'm going to get my ass taxed so much. If you sell over $20,000 on eBay, the IRS man comes looking for you. And whenever I... So I'm going to get taxed for all the stuff that I sold on eBay this year. Right? And then... By doing my income tax and everything, that's going to show, that's going to be, that's going to prove to the federal government that I was making money when I was getting unemployment. So I don't know how that works. I got to figure all that stuff out. I might have to just call unemployment randomly on the phone and just ask them. Maybe I can just Google it. Because they ask you, have you worked any hours? And they ask you all these questions and no, I haven't worked, but... You know, I do have this kind of side deal going on, a little side hustle on eBay. So I, is that considered work? I, I don't know. And if I try to claim stuff, receipts and all that shit at the end of the year, am I making it work? Should I not make it work? It's very confusing. All right, guys, that's it. Miller's Cafe, 4.2 cheeseburger. Oh, the Frito pie. I'm going to give this a 0.6. No, 0. 0.5. Half of a fucking one point. <laughs> Terrible. Yeah, I'm still eating it. All right, guys, that's it. I'll talk to you guys later. I don't feel like doing the peace out today. I'm just kind of in a... I'm in one of these moods. It's rained for literally two days straight. Peace out. <laughs>